management. And uh, I'm also the first corporate free candidate elected to the Richmond City Council. Our city of 110,000 people now has five corporate free council members out of seven. donations and rely instead on small donations from many individuals. More importantly, I had an organization behind me, an organization that I helped build and create that works with me and the other progressives on the council. This organization is called the Richmond Progressive Alliance. contingent in this march, so a big shout out to the RPA contingent. <laughs> you know, this organization was key to all four of my electoral successes and to the successes of the other corporate free uh, elected officials. Like I said, we now have a corporate free progressive super majority <laughs> in a city in a city that was dominated by Chevron for a hundred years. And you know, just a few years ago, most of the city council was either in Chevron's pocket or was totally intimidated from this giant oil company. But not anymore. <laughs> Today, I serve on the City Council with Vice Mayor Jovanka Beckles, Council Member Eduardo Martinez, Council Member Mel Melvin Willis, and Council Member Ben Choi, all of us elected because of the RPA without any corporate money. And we've done it from the bottom up with our diverse community. Today, our RPA Steering Committee has a majority of women on its board and a majority of people of color. That's what our diversity 